the THR West team is, it's an incredible organization uh, made up of everybody's volunteering to be here. So you're seeing upwards of 40 people working as one team and uh, it's great to be involved with it at all. 2004 was the year that kind of triggered the team and restarted our team and that was for Thunder Hill. We had seven people that went to that race to, to field one car and we quickly realized how difficult it is to do a 25 hour event with just seven people. With a team of say small races you would have maybe 10 guys. Up to 25 hour races we would have 40. You actually start to really feel the team needs you and then you have a a group, team members, where you depend on each other. Your contribution, no matter how big or how small, is actually all necessary. And then that, in a way, I believe, keeps people together and then makes everyone feel important. Honda PR started to really support our team because we understand Honda philosophy. So it's easy for Honda to deliver a message through R&D guys. We tell everyone this is a streetable race car or a raceable street car. So it would be a good opportunity to prove that. Not only the Type R, but we drove ridge lines to tow our cars up here, and that's something we developed in Torrance. So it's really useful to actually have a hand in playing around with the products and seeing ways we can improve them and seeing what their full capabilities are. It really makes you feel good about something you worked on. Miss qualifying, but um as long as we stay out of trouble, it's a very long race, and we just got to do laps and laps and laps. So we've got time to work our way through the pack and uh, hopefully get back in the front. Preparation and logistics are everything in a 25-hour race, um, not just for the things that you can predict, but the things that you can't predict. This year in particular, it's the first year in a couple that we're going to see weather. Uh, impacting that. So not only is it grip, but it's visibility changing conditions uh, and then dealing with other people as they're changing conditions and adapting, uh, that will add another level of challenge on top of that. I've met so many people in other Honda locations and other Honda departments that I never would have met without this program. You'll be very surprised to see that everybody has that just that enough specialty and different knowledge that the team requires. Without racing, I don't think Honda would exist. That's sort of how it all started. So still see that support. It's hard to get that anywhere else. I went from racing Hondas in Gran Turismo when I was a kid to racing them in real life. So never thought I would do that. I'm really thankful to Honda for that experience. The, the passion involved is what kind of brings everybody back and has that feeling of level of commitment and dedication to the to the team and the overall experience.